Hey guys, welcome back. Um, so I want you to play Death Subtractor. <laughs> Bro, I'm just thinking, if you're a horse person, then one of the best things about that is you can poop while running. Yeah. It's like, no, no fuss, no muss. But if you turn back into a person, what becomes of your feces? Well, my question. okay, so on that same token, you have to consider that horses eat almost entirely grass and grains that are fed to them. So, like... Your diet's going to be, if you yeah. eat a regular human diet, you are going to be probably in for a bad time. I guess you have to be real careful about what you eat and when, depending on how likely this you are to go sucks. on horse. Maybe, okay, so if you have a horse body, then you have the horse stomach. So when you're when you're a human body, you but. have the human stomach. So, like, so what's it, in your human torso? Uh, yeah. I mean, it's all fucking magic, doesn't it? So it's like, <laughs> well, it's doesn't matter. Centaurs aren't magic, Kyle. Well, it's are magic you, when you change. Are you not nerd enough? I don't know. I don't. I don't have that monster manual. I, the stomach isn't as important as the colon that that post seeds it, right? <laughs> sure. Right? I mean, the uh, the the stomach's capable of doing whatever it does, but I'm talking just in terms of sheer volume. But you do raise a point. I mean, what have you ate horse sushi? Yeah. You know. We were yeah. turn into literally just talking about that today. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> on is there is that cannibalism? On two different vo uh, voyages I've taken in the hopes of getting horse sashimi and was denied. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Everyone always talks a big game uh, about horse sashimi until it comes down to getting horse sashimi. Yeah. I thought you said horse sashimi. We were going to take you to one of those places. I mean, I'd eat that too, but... I mean, I've... <laughs> <laughs> I want to eat horse sashimi off of a naked woman. I want you misheard me on two accounts. I mean, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> horse sashimi was very expensive though. It was like fifty dollars to even look at it. They wouldn't fuck. Even <laughs> to even they would look just wheel it out on a little curio, yeah, and inside of a glass case. They didn't want your yeah, the, eyes to like make direct photonic contact. You right? Gaijin, you're gonna ruin this fucking goddamn horse sashimi that someone will actually pay for and enjoy. Wow, that magic really did nothing. You can't turn it into shit. I love how upset this guy sounds. Well, I do like that. Uh, I, uh, <laughs> yeah. I appreciate that they finally took the effort to try to add a, like a Z axis sections to these, right? Yeah. You switch. They're trying. A beat em up where you go forward. Was well, this game released in 1998? <laughs> this was um, inspired kind of by. What's that? That. Never mind. I... Wrestling moves. <laughs> that. Uh, Bro, fuck. You... Contra. Contra has some modes like this. Bro. Yeah. Bro, Nick, if we're not editing a flurry of fart noises when Kyle's stuttering and trying to think of a name of a very famous video game franchise, yeah. I will personally... I'll say this. I story. know that to you, that is the funniest thing that can happen. No, no, no. <laughs> if, if he could somehow vomit or throw in some people vomiting, that would be... <laughs> That'd be the funniest thing to him. Uh, you know what? In that case where you're stumbling over your words so much, I would find that very funny to <laughs> edit in somebody trying yeah. to speak and then <laughs> just oh, make powerful. Show, well, show. Not, it'd wreck it for me if we had control over it. What's so funny about it is how it's uncontrollable. Like, it happens on its own schedule. Well, that's yeah, what I, you know, yeah. Do you have, like, uh, stock footage of little kids trying not to throw up? <laughs> <laughs> it's more funny the more dignity is being destroyed by it. Though. Yeah, like kids don't have any, so that doesn't count. <laughs> yeah, that would be funny, like to get arrested for like having what, a bunch of kids oh. vomiting on your computer. Thank you. Why the fuck do I make apples? Thanks. That's so stupid. Thanks for apples, you dumb asshole. <laughs> You're a horse, you idiot. Oh. Not right now. Feeding them to a horse. Do you this have to the feed human the human stomach. version of her an apple with like? Do you have to like hold the apples with your palm held flat <laughs> up, or she like bites your fingers? Yeah, but she does that more out of principle. <laughs> yeah. Does she as smart as a horse or as a human? That's what I want to know. I have many questions. Well, part she is more martial inclined, so she doesn't have to be that smart. Yeah. Are, are horses smart? I don't know. No. no. Horses, Hor I mean, they're st horses okay. are so fucking stupid. <laughs> okay. I don't know how mammals work. Some of them are smart or something. I don't sure, know. You can train them to do tricks. But um, I don't remember if I've told this story on here before, but uh, I was working on a music video set, and it was out on a farm because they wanted, it, you know, it was like country shit. 
Um, mm -hmm. so, and we were setting up a mirror board outside that would reflect up into a barn. And so at, that the cowboy would look into it and see a skull version of himself? Was it Eldritch Country? Uh, well, it was mostly just like they wanted to have a little bit of fill light so that the inside of this barn was not so fucking dark. Because it's a barn. Because it's a barn, and there's not a lot of natural barn. light coming in there. Uh, how do you grow horses if you don't? If you don't. Yeah, they need a lot of sunlight. Anyway, um, so at some point in the middle of the shoot, the light goes dark, and they're like, "What the fuck?" And somebody looks outside, and the horses are like stomping on the mirror board because <laughs> they hate <laughs> the horse. Well, uh, it's not like a full mirror. It was. It was like a. It was just a reflective board. It was a flat surface, but like, I went. They were like, "Hey, go set it back up and see what you can do about that." And I'm like, "All right." So I go outside, and it is surrounded by horses. And I have never dealt with a horse personally. I've dealt with a lot of exotic, large animals. I have never dealt with a. This is weird. Yeah. Uh, I have never dealt with a horse. So I don't know what their temperament is like. Uh, <laughs> and shit. it gets kicked to like full force in the chest. Yeah. So and that's what begets his whole Colonel Sanders adventure fantasy. So I, so I go outside and I try to get this reflective board set back up so that it will angle back into the barn. And these horses keep coming up and trying to paw at it with their hooves. And I mean, they're horses. They stand taller than I do. And there were several of them surrounding me. I'm like, I can't, like, slap a horse and tell it to fuck off. You could, though. Well, yeah, I wasn't aware of the <laughs> power I possessed, I guess. But I was like, <laughs> if they decide to, they all, each of them, outweighs me, like, double or triple. Oh, way more than that. <laughs> yeah, you know, so, like, bare minimum. Uh, so I'm like, I, I don't really want that to happen to me. And they're like... It was like, make the horses leave. I was like, uh... How? Yeah. I, I get that. Yeah, That's one, a... I don't run this fucking farm. And two, how do you do that? How do you ask a horse you to leave, a motherfucker? a lot of apples. Yeah. You gotta trail apples into the woods. So, That's... yeah, so I'm, I'm out here on this... On these people's farm, just like... Trying to chew off horses, and the closer they get to me, I start getting, like, a little bit nervous. I'm like, they are ganging up. <laughs> I don't like this, and I came a, a hoodlum of horses. I came about a hair's breadth away from like punching a horse. Like back the fuck up. We'll see what happens. <laughs> and that's how that's Nick some dies. We all knew it would involve punching an animal. Yeah, I've ridden <laughs> camels. I've ridden elephants, oxen. I've ridden all sorts of like unconventional rides. You know, Nick, you never really told a us bear? why you got into your current line of work, and now I understand. You punched a horse. Yeah. You know, I was never allowed back. I would have thought you were cool if you had just told us that. Sorry. Well, I couldn't have that now, could I? <laughs> I can sign you to IT hell for your crimes against me. <laughs> for your crimes against horse. Shit. Kyle, stop well, shooting me. In I any was event, trying to shoot the fucking asshole. The, I was trying to shoot the little person. I wonder why horses were interested in a reflecting board. I assume there may be... That, that speaks to maybe a hint of intelligence if they didn't well, get bored. No. Uh, what I was told was because it reflects, they most likely assumed it to be water, and, mm. they, and they could not get their hooves into it, which frustrated uh -huh. their efforts to get water. I always assume it's because animals are so stupid that they can't recognize themselves in a reflection, so they just thought it was another animal, and they're like, fuck that horse yeah, in the ground. It, it was it was a dulled surface. It wasn't a, a mirror, but yeah, yeah. it's uh, it all all the same. Like like I said, they, somebody thought, like, they probably think it's water because it reflects the sun, but they can't drink it, so it's confusing their tiny brains. So knowing our or audience... Or they know you're working hard and making... A, they're like, it's costing you money, and they're fucking with you in order to be fuckers, and that is what I prefer to believe. So knowing our audience, someone's going to be a fucking horse expert and be like, actually... Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> yeah, well, here's a, a preemptive response. Fuck you. For being a horse expert? Yeah. And then, uh, For being horse people at all. Hmm. 
You mean like the kind of horse people you're playing as, or just the like, <laughs> play horses? Oh, good. The elevator is a fucking beetle. Good. Oh. <laughs> they can't help being centaurs, Nick. No, they can't. But but, but like, they are the product yeah. of a crime. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I guess the centaur what implies a man and a horse fucked. Didn't yeah, they? horse fuckery is illegal in most states. I, no, 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 no. Nick, no. I think we can safely say across or, the nation. Or, I don't know that that's true, though. Or a horse fucked a person. In which case, that's just misfortune. Well, that's how you get <laughs> no a Mr. Hand act. situation. Oh. You can't... And that you guy can't, died. You can't, you can't... You can't send a horse to jail. <laughs> <laughs> no, you can't shoot it without questioning. It, it does kind of bother <laughs> yeah, me that, like, it's not illegal to marry a child, but you... you it's not... It, it, it's not illegal to marry a child. I'm pretty sure it is. Dude, like... It's not in some yeah, states. Yeah, I think, like, West Virginia or Kentucky, the age of consent is shockingly low. Yeah. And, and I like, thought it was understood that we were talking about Earth, though. No, we're we are talking about <laughs> this, in fact, country. We're not, we're uh, not talking about I got about what you were going for, like and Earth. I appreciate that. <laughs> We're talking about real locations, though, not like fantasy realms. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. it's theoretically legal to marry a hobbit too, but that's not neither here nor there. You know, uh, well, it's not illegal to marry a hobbit. Yeah, there's that lady who married a pirate's ghost. So what? fuck it, anything's possible. How did? <laughs> I don't know that that is legally binding whatsoever. Um, How do you get the court? To recognize that. I'm sure that never went to any sort of institution that cared. <laughs> also, I just realized that uh, somehow this centaur paints her hooves like, you know, <laughs> like, like, nail like painting polish. your nails. Uh, How does she reach them? Someone else has to do it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Down. <laughs> oh, or, yeah like, Nick, haven't you ever seen racist Disney cartoons from the 40s? <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> There's ways. There's ways. Well, anyway. <laughs> I don't if, like... if someone can marry an anime, why can't they marry whatever else? Yeah, that dude you know? who married his Game Boy. Yeah. Uh, All I'm sorts of shit. about that. Kyle, aren't you... You managed to beat the spread and marry an actual human woman. That's... that's <laughs> for, the spread. <laughs> for given gamers? how many... Given how many pitfalls there are. Yeah, in general, like for 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 fuckabouts, for for for, for strange women, for strange men. I'm, that's a new word. Like not strange hey. space men, strange men. Like one word. <laughs> was that the sound of the skeleton falling? There was a really oh, rad eh. scream earlier. That, like uh, we didn't comment on. There are no, a lot I want to talk about it now. That it's been several minutes. <laughs> Let's, Kyle, make sure you cap all the Nick utterances so we can make more remixes. Yeah, what's the... Just Nick, start saying some random weird shit. That's all I do. And also, just, just oh, you yeah. know, remember exact timestamps for when you heard a weird scream so that I can highlight it <laughs> and crank up the volume and peak audio so that everyone who watches this episode hates it. Um, yeah. That's... You're assuming anybody's watching well, this. <laughs> Everyone you haven't alienated by talking shit about horses. <laughs> yeah, like, uh, strangely, MCI I had and horse likers is a really large portion of the Venn diagram. Whoops. Who knew? Yeah. I've been, uh, I've been around horses on many occasions, you know. My, my parents my, have horses. My equals in capacity for human thought. Well, you know, our channel is specifically built for and by horses, dork ass nerds, oh. and dork ass nerds have a high propensity for being horse people. <laughs> um, also, I'll bet a handful of you are like the sort of weirdos who are very specifically into like Celtic and Gaelic fantasy stuff over, you know, just boilerplate fantasy things. Huh. Only one of those well, syllables. Why do you think that specifically? Because statistically. Statistically. Yeah, it has to be true. All right. Uh, he had a lot of time to think about this at the bottom of that river, Kyle. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. This information passed into his brain. Are we like making references to a, a completely different game at this point? Sure. What? Who? Huh? Hello. What? Huh? Where? Uh, hello. Hello. 